one. Positive climb. Gear up. As you've heard, the communications over the shortwave radio are rather difficult. Therefore, there is an in-flight broadcasting procedure where every aircraft will report his position in about 20 minutes interval. So that each aircraft flying along the same route is advised about conflicting traffic. We're staying in contact with each other and eventually we climb or descend to avoid each other if there is any conflicting traffic around. It's the only way to assure that we uh, avoid some near misses which from time to time do happen over Africa. The whole area of Africa is concerned except for uh, the Moroccan and the South African regions. It's a mandatory procedure and everybody keeps a sharp watch on that frequency. All station, uh, traffic information, this is Sabina 515. Southbound from uh, Brussels to Lagos on the upper green 855. We will check position in AMA at uh, 1344. Gazon will be 1407. Sabina 515, southbound flight level 350. All set? I'll set 500 feet. Checks. Briefing, Roger. I fly, it's full uh, takeoff, radar on, engine failure before V1. I'll call stop or go and I'll perform the stopping actions. You monitor the brakes, the speed brakes, and the reverse. Roger. After V1, uh, it's a standard procedure straight ahead 1700 feet for the EFRA and we climb to the safety altitude and we take 3100 which is also for the first 100 nautical miles. Okay. The departure, Logan 2 departure, expecting runway 2 to right, it's a left turn after takeoff to heading 140 and ask, I will ask for a heading pull 140 after takeoff, Roger. dense departure, expect radar vectors Jet aircraft maintain 5,000 and 5,000 is set. V1, runway 8. Yeah. 
positive plan. Gear up. Nav 3, heading cell 140. Heading cell 140. Heading green. Check. Tonight, Sabina 534 Heavy. Best and good evening, Sabina 534 Heavy. Zero nine zero one four thousand for the Sabina 534. Coming from the system that the trim tank transfer has started. What is the trim tank transfer? In order to save fuel and route, the fuel which is located in the uh, wing is transferred to an aft tank which is located in the tail. By transferring the fuel to this aft tank, the center of gravity moves backwards to something like 39 or 40 percent center of gravity. Due, due to that fact, this airplane will have about 1 percent less fuel consumption in route. First of all, there is a little disequilibrium between the two tanks and whenever we are hitting the same figures, you will see that also from this tank, fuel will be transferred to the aft transfer tank. Just in a second you will see an arrow coming up pointing that fuel is transferring to the aft. Traffic between 1994 and 1998 almost doubled to nearly 9 million passengers, with 10 million expected in 1999. Sabina was the first European airline and second in the world to cross-train and qualify its pilots to fly both the A330 and A340. The arrival of 34 new A319, A320 and A321s, which have similar cockpits, will increase crew productivity while reducing training and other expenses. The new A330s and A340s are allowing Sabina to continue its network expansion. Besides the new long-haul destinations added in the last year, Sabina is also looking into new service to India, China, and the Americas on top of increased frequencies on existing routes. Boston and Johannesburg now have daily service. We hope you've enjoyed this new Sabina flight in the cockpit, and we hope to see you again soon for our 747 to Chicago.